here at the Island Resort and Casino for the weekend. And we're staying at the tower that's on this end of the complex. And you can get your yeah, um, special suite. This hot water park's over there at that tower. So we do have to walk through the casino to get to it. But I guess it's allowed as long as there's an adult with the children. All right, this is the casino that we have to walk through to get to our room. So, yeah, our room's over here in the sun tower. And we're on the sixth floor. Okay, we made it to the island resort. And here's our room that we're staying at for the weekend. It's got a nice big bathroom with a nice shower. And there's a lot of uh, complimentary soaps and things. And then we have a little coffee station here, but we have a jacuzzi tub and uh, a little foyer area here and there's a table. And we have a nice room with two beds and we have a refrigerator here and a microwave and a TV, a chair. We got two beds here. We got a um, rollaway cot because we brought three kids with us. And uh, that's pretty much the tour of the room. So this is the island resort uh, water area, kind of a small water park, splash pad, water slides over here. And we have like a lily pad thing here and a pool and a little lazy river and a more of a splash pad over there. And then there's a kind of a clover leaf um, whirlpool over here. Right now the Water features aren't turned on. They don't turn on until a little bit later on this afternoon, but you can enjoy the pool and uh, the hot tub for now. So that's what we're doing. So the hot tub is very hot and it's very large. Yeah, like four of these little hot tub pods. Feels really good. Okay, try to get across. <laughs> down the water slide. It's starting to tip, move up quick. Oh, <laughs> bad.
<laughs> yeah. Bubble bath. Here's a Sandpoint Lighthouse Museum, but it just closed. Closed at four and it's 4.30, so we're not gonna be able to go inside, I guess. We're in uh, Escanaba. By the water, and it's very windy. Here's another vantage point of the lighthouse. It says it was rehabilitated. beach in Escanaba that opens up to Lake Michigan. It's actually sandy, very sandy. Oh, wow, look at all the people. Here we are at the Rapid River Falls. But there's like, uh, we're getting attacked by mosquitoes, so I don't know how long we can stay here. Looks like it's a bug a, on the log. It's a shallow, I'm surprised there's mosquitoes since it's a river. Okay, here's another part of the falls down here. I think the water is very low. What's, oh, wow. Little claws. So the water is very low, so the falls are just this little part right here. What if I just fell in? Well, don't fall in. These are the Rapid River Falls. So you get off the elevator. And this is the Horizon Steakhouse. It's up on the 12th floor. And you have to go down this hallway. That looks like the Wizard of Oz's entrance to the wizard chambers here, to the steakhouse. It's a long hallway, and it takes you here to the entrance to the steakhouse on the 12th floor. This is the Horizon Steakhouse, at the very top on the 12th floor. This is their menu. I ordered ribs and it came with mac and cheese. All of the kids got a uh, shrimp basket. Uh, dish with sausage and shrimp, or what, is that what's in there? I'll try the ribs. And they're very good. Hot, very hot. They're very good though. the water on our way home. Pit stop here on our way home at a little rest stop it's by the lake. Can you see? Oh, you need 50 cents? You sure you want to spend 50 cents on that? What's that? Pretty, huh? Here's the lake shore. Found a kind of a river over here. Uh oh, wait, you know what? There's mosquitoes. Let's head back. I don't want to get attacked by mosquitoes again. Let's head back. We stopped here at the scenic overlook. 
you got the uh, straight here. And then it's a little bit difficult to see, but the Mackinac Bridge is in the background. Then I'll zoom in here. So there's the Mackinac Bridge. Five miles long. You have to cross that to get from the uh, lower peninsula to the upper peninsula of Michigan or vice versa. So we're in the upper peninsula right now. We've got to cross it to get back to the lower peninsula, the one that looks like the mitten. So it's the last bridge we got to go over to get back home. We got like about a four hour drive from there.